Welcome to Channel Game IQ and a very happy new year to you all. There's some fantastic games being released over the next couple of months and in 2022. And I'm going to do my very best to preview the very best of them. Today we're going to get started with the fantastic looking Rainbow Six Extraction. Don't forget to leave me a comment and let me know what you think of this game. And also, I'm very intrigued to find out what games you're most looking forward to in 2022. So leave me a comment and maybe I may well do a preview of one of those as well. Okay, we're going to get started with the trailer, and then we're going to take a look and have a chat about the gameplay. The until a piece of it fell. And the nightmare began. We thought it could be contained. But it evolved. So we did too. One of our own is MIA. I need an extraction team, now. If there's a way to stop them, you will find it. But I know you will find me first. Okay, the plan. Nomad, secure our exit. I'll take out the nests. And I'll find you by now. I have your signal. Let's go. We are already out of the nests. Incoming! Clear the area! Stand back! <laughs> yeah, too bad you missed all the fireworks. Team, it's Ash. We're not done yet. VIP. Some Archies seem to be communicating with an elite. We can't have their leader rally a group, or containment will be near impossible. 
Tom Clancy's Rainbow Six Extraction, originally known as Tom Clancy's Rainbow Six Quarantine, is an upcoming tactical shooter developed by Ubisoft Montreal and published by Ubisoft. It's a spin-off of Rainbow Six Siege 2015. Extraction is a cooperative multiplayer game in which players must work together to combat and defeat a type of parasite-like aliens called the Archeans. The game is set to be released for Microsoft Windows, PlayStation 4, PlayStation 5, Amazon Luna, Google Stadia, Xbox One, Xbox Series X and Series S on the 20th of January 2022. Okay, on to the gameplay. Rainbow Six Extraction is a cooperative multiplayer game that can support up to three players. In Extraction, the operators must infiltrate an alien infested location and complete objectives such as collecting samples, extracting materials from the computers and gathering intel. Each play session, known as the Incursion, is made up of three interconnected sub-maps and players will be assigned any one of 12 objectives randomly in each sub-map. The location of the objectives and the placement of enemies are procedurally generated. Once the player secures their objective, they can choose to extract themselves or explore the next sub-map. The new area will be more difficult than the previous one, but players will receive more rewards by completing them successfully. Extracting early ensures that all the operators would be safe. If an operator is taken down by an enemy, they will become missing in the action, and players cannot play as them until they are rescued from the extraction mission. Characters which are severely injured in previous missions will also remain hurt and will only recover slowly. Many operators from Siege return in Extraction as they have formed the Rainbow Exogenius Analysis and Containment Team, known as REACT, in order to contain the alien threat. Before the commencement of missions, players can choose their operator from a pool of 18. Each operator has their own unique weapons and gadgets. For instance, one may have heartbeat sensor that allows him to spot enemies through walls, while another can deploy a holographic decoy to distract enemies. Team composition is essential for success as the players in the same session must select three different characters. Like Siege, players can send out recon drones to scout the area, reinforce doors and windows to seal entrances and shoot through walls. Players must work together and coordinate with each other in order to succeed. The game is a ping system which allows players to reveal the locations of hostile threats and resources to other players. The aliens featured in the game are called Archeans. In addition to the standard enemies, there are also special variants such as spikers that can shoot sharp projectiles from their body and routers that can slow the players down significantly. Areas are covered with a compound lime named Sprawl. Players' speed is significantly slowed down while they stand on Sprawl, while enemies will become much stronger. Sprawl can be repelled by shooting at it. Unlike most other cooperative multiplayer games, Extraction has a slower pace. Players' health does not regenerate, and health pickup supplies and ammo are scarce. If the player is detected by an opponent after making too much noise, it will shriek and attract other enemies. So stealth is very much encouraged.
So that brings us to the end of the preview. Is this game one for your collection? Let me know by leaving me a comment below. Until the next time, thanks for watching Channel Game IQ. Set the operator down in the extraction pod.